Hi guys! For today's video, I'm going to show you a very very easy eyeshadow application technique. Kung baguhan ka sa makeup at na overwhelm ka sa dami ng eyeshadow na pwede mong pagpilian, na hindi mo alam kung paano sila lahat ilagay or paano sila i-apply sa yung talukap, well, this video is for you, so keep on watching. So, it's very easy to work with matte shadows. Um, you just put them everywhere and they're easy to blend. Pero what are you going to do if you have a palette that has little matte shadows or sometimes no matte shadows at all? Well, today, I have here an example of a palette na um, basically isa lang yung kanyang matte shadow. And I have here the pink palette of EB Advance, Ever Belena. And if you're from, uh, familiar with this palette, itong white na shade dito, ito lang ang uh, matte uh, shade here. And the rest are uh, shimmery. See? Shimmery shades yung ibang nandito. So basically, what can you do with this palette? Okay? Kung baguhan ka sa makeup at na-overwhelm ka, Ito gi share ko sa inyo ngayon is very very easy and very very doable. Sobrang dali lang ito. Okay. So, for this, I will be using this palette uh, to show you how easy this technique is. Okay. Uh, I'm going to choose a shade. So, this one, I'm going to choose. This is also a shimmery shade. So, what I'm going to do, I'm going to use this um, eyeshadow applicator that comes with this palette. Okay. What I'm going to do basically is, well, I have um, my eye, uh, what do you call this, eyelids primed already and um, powdered. So, ang gagawin ko guys is I'm going to dab this here and pick up the shade. And then, okay, I'm going to use this basically to pick up yung shade. Kasi sometimes, ang problema kapag shimmery shades or may mga glitter siya, maraming um, fallouts. So, to have minimal, uh, minimum or minimal fallouts, ito yung gagamitin ko. And to get the intensity of the shade. So, I will pick this up and then, hold on. I will apply it and tap it on my mobile lid. Okay, guys. I'm going to apply it dito sa lid na gumagalaw. Yung na-open and nako-close. And then, I will stop here, dun sa aking crease, kung nasan yung tupi ng aking um, taluka. Okay? So, let me just pick up the shade. And I will dab. Dab and swipe. there. Okay. And then, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to get a fluffy brush and then blend out the edges. We blend lang natin yung edges para hindi naman siya harsh. There you go. Okay. 
there. So that is called an eyeshadow wash. And yun yung pinaka basic na pwede natin gawin sa eyeshadow natin. Uh, especially if you have shimmery shades like this one. And nakaka-intimidate siya. Let's try another shade para makita nyo na pwede talaga siyang mag-work. Um, siguro this time I will choose um, this one, yung copper shade. Okay, so let me see a clean, clean side. So, hanggang dun lang sa um, tupe or trees ng ating palukap. See? Okay. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to blend it a bit yung edges para naman hindi masyadong harsh. Okay, so, parang nag-fade yung dulo niya. Yung kanyang edges. sa medyo light yung color. Can you see? Intensify pa natin itong isang shape. Okay. Alam nyo guys, itong applicator, okay. sa mga beauty gurus na nakikita ko online, they rarely, rarely use itong mga makeup applicators and sometimes they even just throw it out Pero guys, believe me, may silbi itong mga eyeshadow applicators na to. Kasi, way, way before, nung bata pa ako, na, na before nung una ako natutong mag, mag put on ng makeup, I really use this. Okay? And it works naman. It works. But then now that there are a lot of brushes coming up, um, wala na halos kumagamit ito. They only use this, um, fluffy brush. Um, ang isasuggest ko lang sa inyo, if you're going to do this eyeshadow wash, don't use a fluffy brush, especially if you are working with shimmery shades or shades with um, glitters, kasi maraming fallouts. Promise guys, if I try to do this with this one, ang dami ng product na nakakalat. Pero kita nyo naman dito, hindi, hindi, hindi siya masyadong makalat. And at the same time, dito sa akin, wala siya masyadong nalaglag na product. Had I used a fluffy brush, ganun yung mangyayari. Kasi parang dinadust off mo lang yung um, product. In this case, what I did is to tap. Tap and, um, ano ba yun? Tap and drag a bit. Tapping motions, basically, ang ginawa ko para ma-pack in yung color and uh, para ma-concentrate at dumikit siya talaga dun sa lid. Instead of um, blending or buffing it away, yun yung mangyayari. So, there. Actually, guys, you can also use this technique with your uh, matte shadows, especially if you have popping matte shades, you could simply do an eyeshadow wash. Talagang siya lang all over the mobile lid and then simply blend out the crease and then clean it up or brighten it up kasi sometimes you might get um, ano yun, a little bit higher when you 
um, blend. So, simply put um, kung napa-over yung inyong um, pagbe-blend, uh, a light shade like this, okay, to clean it up, lagi nyo lang dun sa may um, brow bone, and that will help clean up your color. Just like so. There! I'm losing light. There. Nagita nyo ba, guys? Simple lang siya. So, I hope meron kayo natutunan dito sa video nito. And if you get intimidated, again, with your eyeshadow, simply remember that you can just do an eyeshadow wash all over your lids. And then, that's it. So, guys, thank you so much for watching this video. Sana may natutunan kayo. Please don't forget to subscribe. And if you happen to have tried this, um, technique before, let me know down in the comment section below. I hope to see you again on my next video. Thank you for watching. Bye!